Welcome back everyone. In this video, we're gonna be unboxing and reviewing the Maui Gym Even Keel Sunglasses. These in particular were purchased through Costco and this incredible price is way too good to pass up. So I wanted to get my hands on them and do a thorough review. In comparison, if you look at these glasses sold through Nordstrom or other particular sellers, it's almost triple the price, if not more. When purchasing these through Costco, not only do you have the peace of mind that you can return these for whatever reason at any time at Costco, but also you're going to get these directly from a reputable seller, if not directly from Maui Gym. So you're not gonna be getting any knockoffs or any issues like you do on Amazon or other sellers as. Okay, quickly, let's look at the boxing and the packaging that it comes in. Quite a large box for what it is, but it is quite secure. Let's have a look at the exterior. If you are looking this up in the future, here's the particular item number for this color. Okay, let's have a look inside. Make sure to stay tuned. I will be putting these on my face at the end so you can see how they fit. Let's take a quick peek into the pamphlet. Here it's listed that we have a two year warranty from the date of purchase. And I noticed here that it's listing these lens as optical class one. And if we look here, it's limited protection against sun glare. So these lens are a bit lighter since they have that ombre lighter bottom, darker top. But I've used these for a few, few weeks now and I'm really loving the lighter bottom. So I'll get into that in a bit. Let's go over this first. Here we can see the manufacturer is coming out of Illinois. And what I may assume is that they're making the lens in the US and they're making the frame in Italy because the frame on the arm, it says made in Italy. On the rear, if we look, level one would be partly cloudy, partly sunny. And again, I use these to drive on a daily basis here in Southern California. So we have a lot of sun on a regular basis. And personally, I prefer these to my Ray-Ban wafers and such because those lens are very, very dark, which is good for sunlight, but they can make you kind of drowsy. Whereas these let in a bit more light while still offering that polarized protection and offering that UV protection as well. Okay, next let's look into this case. The interior has a nice micro suede finish. Here we have our nice tropical cleaning cloth. This case is nice. I do think it is way oversized for what it is though. You can see there's a lot of extra space there. So although this case is collapsible, I think it is quite bulky for what these glasses are. And in reality, something much more compact would have been beneficial due to the fact that you can put this in your back pocket or you're more likely to be able to store it in a backpack or suitcase or something. I do like that it is collapsible, but again, this is quite bulky for what it is. Okay, let's have a closer look. On the upper right lens, we have the Maui Gym Signature. This is not etched, but it is on there nicely. One thing you will notice with these glasses is when I first saw them, they had more of a leathery look on these brown accents. And it's not to say that I dislike this look, but it is more of this frosted plastic. And one of the benefits of this frosted material and even this matte metal is that it hardly, if at all, shows fingerprints. So aside from the lens, you're not really gonna get fingerprints on any of these pieces here. It's like this frosted plastic, if you can see there. So I think they look a little more premium in the pictures, but in person, I'm appreciating this plastic-ish material due to the fact that it's probably going to be light. And it's, it's also, like you can see there, 
not showing any fingerprints. Let's look at the inside arms. 51, 24, 140 are your measurements. And here it says 100% made in Italy. So I'm just a bit confused because the brochure pamphlet says manufactured in Illinois. So I'm not sure if they're just referring to this frame or the lens as well. The other side, even keel. Okay, let's have a look at the hinge. And for your nose, these are adjustable, so you can make it tighter or loose to accommodate your different nose sizes. Okay, and now I'll give you an impression of what it's like to look through the lens. We're going to have this plum hue with a darker shade up top. And the reason I'm starting to like lenses like this is that even though you can see your eyes through these, this top darker part is going to block the sun coming from the top and the bottom lighter part here allows you to read something much more easily. And it also allows you to see the road without less of that dark tint. So again, this dark tint, from my understanding, is probably beneficial to block the sun, which is coming from the top. And this bottom part allows you to look down at things much easier. And there is a manufacturing defect I would like to point out that could cause injury to you. When you have these glasses folded and you slide these into your shirt, the front of your shirt which is very common this corner here is very sharp and jagged and i already cut my neck pulling them up so i was removing them from my t-shirt lifting up and in that process this corner already cut my neck so i left like a one inch good little scab on my neck for about a week so we see here these corners are very sharp looking closer either of these corners here or here will definitely cut your neck if you're not careful taking these out. So I just wanted to point that out that that is a defect and just keep that in mind if you are putting these on your t-shirt and pulling them up, you can cut your neck pulling them up in that process. All right, everyone, here we have them. Let's have a better look so you can see how they fit on a face. If you notice, you can see that there's somewhat of that peanut butter brown look, which I think blends with a lot more than the other offering that Costco offers, which is that sandstone it's like a white ivory these are going to be a bit more subdued all right so after using these for a few days i will be listing the pros and cons even though these are slightly front heavy the only reason that you notice that is because overall the glasses are just so light that you will notice that i've worn these for hours on end for multiple days already and the front nose extremely comfortable my ears on the top of my ears i have no discomfort whatsoever when you fold these down, they are very compact and very slim, so they're not gonna be as bulky as a lot of other sunglasses you might have. The next pro, these lens with the ombre finish, I'm really starting to like, and just the fact that I can look down and see things much easier, but also have this darker tint on top, so if the sun's hitting, it's gonna give me a bit more protection, is just brilliant. Next pro, because these are polarized, they're awesome to drive with, and they're also great for outdoors if you are doing fishing or any sort of water activities where you get that glare off the water. Next, we have the cons. The first is that this corner on either end is very, very jagged and just a better look. When you have them tucked in your shirt like this and you need to pull them out, you're gonna pull straight up. You can see there that corner is pushing into your neck. So if you push up and drag it, this is enough to snag and cut your skin here. So again, that already happened, it already healed up on me, but I just wanna point that out, that that is something that can cause injury if you're not paying attention. My next con is going to be this case. I do understand that from a cost cutting perspective, it is much cheaper to just generate one generic case that fits a lot more sunglasses, but just because these are so slim, they're gonna be bouncing around a lot because there is a lot of extra space in there. And I do understand that this is collapsible, but if you do put this in your pocket, later on you take it out, it's gonna have a large footprint once you open this up. At the MSRP of $330, I would take those cons with a bit more criticism. Just the fact that these are $103, I immediately overlooked that criticism. You have polarized lens, extremely light, so they're not gonna wear on your nose or your ears. And most importantly, these are sold through Costco. So you're gonna have such a generous return policy, it's ridiculous. And here, for those of you that have long hair, you can get a better look of what they'd look like. Okay, and that concludes the video. 
you have any questions, please do not hesitate to reach out. I'll do the best I can to answer as quickly and accurately as possible. That said, have a great day. Have a great evening. Please remember to like and subscribe if you haven't already. That said, strike her out.